Right, ladies and gentlemen, this is a charming, um, I think 1805, I would imagine. There's a watermark on the paper that says um, KG1804. Um, it's a watercolour of, a, I think, a real scene written on the... Th these are the various concomitant parts of the picture. There's a backboard which has in Georgian handwriting Richard Symes Esquire, Hannington. There's a Hannington in, in Wiltshire, a Hannington in Hampshire. Not sure where Hannington is. Uh, along with the picture come simply two original nails... The original glass, which is is dusty and dirty, which has two, um, which has a sort of a sort of crepe sugar paper old mount around it, now much decayed. Um, the original frame, which I think may have been painted gold at some later stage, but it is, I think, probably the original early nineteenth century frame. But the main thing is the picture itself. Um, there are worm holes um, here, as you can see, but I think any any worms have long gone. But what's interesting is it's not a picturesque Georgian classical sort of made up scene. It's I think a real place. It's obviously a real barn with um, what looks like sort of beet, some sort of beet or turnips or something being poured out of a barn by a farm labourers, four farm labourers, uh, a team of horses, another barn here surrounded by straw, a distant, obviously real geographical hill in the distant, a distance, a church tower and um, chancel there. So it's a Georgian agricultural scene as it was, I think probably painted, you know, sort of from modelled on the life rather than just some imaginary picturesque scene of a barn. And that's what makes it interesting. Georgian agricultural scene. The condition is as you see. Please look, it's a bit frail, it's a bit fragile, but it could all be put together again. And um, as I say, the rarity is the actual agricultural nature of the painting with this wattle, wattle um, barn with a clay roof here, pantiles and thatch. Quite interesting. Thanks so much indeed. Bye.